More talk tonight that international electronics manufacturer Foxconn could be headed to Wisconsin. State Senator Luther Olson telling the Associated Press today talks are ongoing about what incentives to offer the manufacturer. Tom Durian asked Governor Scott Walker about that today. He's live with what the governor had to say. Tom. Well, George, we got the old I can't confirm, I can't deny line from the governor today about a possible Foxconn plant somewhere along Interstate 94, south of where we are here in Racine County. That generally means, you know, that something is up. Now, we know that Speaker Ryan has met with officials from Foxconn on request of the governor, and the company's jet was spotted in the state. Now, Senator Olson even suggested holding off on the budget until we know what kind of incentives the state may offer the electronics manufacturer. The governor stepped back from that suggestion. We do not have a specific proposal on the table. Anything that's being talked about right now is purely speculative. People see that this is a place to do business at, and it's no shock that, that there'd be discussions about a company like Foxconn being interested. Well, the governor applauded the Racine Kenosha area's job growth in the last three years, putting that number at about 10,000. The Foxconn plant will reportedly be a billion dollar facility with 10,000 jobs to come along with it. They assemble the iPhone and flat panel televisions. Reporting live, Tom Durian, today's TMJ4. I share your curiosity about those incentives. Thanks, Tom.